Hi, Rene. Good evening, teacher. Hi, Rene. How are you? Very well. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Thank you, Rene. Hi, Eli. Hello, Eli. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Hi, Jose Luis. Hello. Hi. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? I am good, teacher. Are you? I'm okay. I'm great. I'm happy to be with you again. Okay. How was your day today? Uh, another class. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> I learn more. That's nice. <laughs> so, Jose Luis, are you studying French also or only English? Only, only English. Mm. I, I don't like French because I think it's more <laughs> difficult. But some people, <laughs> but some people say that it's easy because yeah. some words are similar to Spanish. Yeah. But I don't. But think I don't so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's better English. Yeah, I don't. I and mean, it's more, yeah. And it's more used English than French. That's right. Yeah. For me, the pronunciation in French is super difficult. I cannot get it. Because French is with the throat. I know, I know, so I can't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think it's really difficult. It is. But in the in the hotel it, it was it was teaching French. Okay. Yes, but I, I don't don't want. Oh my goodness, Jose Luis. Very good. All right. Now, Jose Luis, if you but, were to... uh -huh. but, but, it, but it's good because it's a, but it, it's good to French because uh, the hotel is easy for French speaker people, speaking people. People from yeah. French. Right, yes. They In speak German? French, yeah. Yes. Yes, because if they are they are, they are flying from Canada from Montreal. Right, from Montreal. The, yeah. Most the people speak French. Yes. Okay. French. Okay. All right. Hi Andrea. Hi, good night. We missed you yesterday, Andrea. What happened? Yes, sorry. <laughs> I had a, a church activity and uh, I can change it. All right, very good. Oh, Oscar's coming. Very nice. Hi, Oscar. Oscar is in the dark today. Hi, Oscar. Hey, how do you do? Fine. Hi, what everyone. about you? I'm okay. Yeah. I slept uh, half of the day. Wow. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> you were like working all day until this uh -huh. morning. Yeah. Sure. So, but you're, you're at home right now then? Yes, yes. Okay. Um, uh, how about you? Uh, how was your day? It was good. Teaching. It was good. Yeah, teaching. <laughs> <laughs> teaching and doing homework with the children and doing the other job I do so it's like a lot of things but yeah I'm okay <laughs> I see I always keep busy keeping busy keeps you out of trouble <laughs> keep that's what they say all right I don't uh, know <laughs> keep your mind out of thinking or out of overthinking yeah uh -huh. all right very good now let's see Elizabeth to learn another language yeah. which other language would you learn uh, i know only spanish a little english 
No, but if you would have to learn another language, if you could choose to learn another language, Elizabeth, which uh, other language would you choose? If I have to choose, I choose English. Okay, but another one besides English? Oh, okay, interesting. All right, very good, okay. What about Jose Luis? If you were to choose another language, Jose Luis, to learn, which language would you choose? I think I choose French yes. because the Mandarin, Mandarin is so difficult. Yeah, all right, okay. What about Oscar? Which other language would you like to learn? Um, do you speak another? Uh, Mandarin, I, I know a few words. Okay. Um, yeah, but I would like to, if I if have, if I have the chance, I will learn um, French. Okay. All right. Because the, because the Mandarin, I I couldn't get the tone. So I mean. <laughs> okay. Uh huh. It's quite uh, difficult. It's, it's quite difficult. I, I, I think it's for young people. For young oh, people. but you're young. I mean, I mean for teenagers ah, and okay. children. <laughs> children and teenagers, you have to learn uh, many characters. Many, yes, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Uh, as a children, uh, as a child, <laughs> yes. as a child, you have to learn so many characters. And after that, you start a process very, it's very hard. Yeah, I imagine. There's a way named pinning, pinning, pinning. Pinning is a way to, to translate the pronunciation okay. into a cell phone. Oh. No characters, but it's, it's an easier way. But, well, Mandarin is there. Uh, I think it's, uh, it's over. <laughs> I mean, I, I will never learn Mandarin. Okay. What about Andrea? If you would have to choose, or if you could choose another language to learn, which one would you choose? Or do you speak another one? Mm, I would like to to learn Mandarin. Oh my goodness! Okay, yeah. Yes, because I think it's very it's useful in yeah. the business world. Right. I think yes. Of that course. is important. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. And one day, one day, <laughs> I went to to learn uh, Italian. Italian oh, Italian. what happened? Uh -huh. <laughs> Why my university. <laughs> oh, and you didn't like it's, it. Uh, Yes, I, I like it, uh, uh -huh. but it's uh, at the same is at the same time of another uh, ah, class right. like career. Oh, ah, okay. Can't. Yeah, you couldn't. Right, yes. very but good. it's very very interesting. Okay, it's yeah. cool. <laughs> cool. All right, very nice. What about Irene? If you could choose another language, Irene, what would you choose? Which other language would you choose? In my case, teacher, only I like uh, English. Not other language? I love it. <laughs> oh, that's nice. No more language. Okay. okay, interesting. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Very good. What about Jesse? Aha, uh -huh, Jesse. If you would be given a chance or an opportunity to learn another language, which other language would you choose? I would like to. Learn about Chino Mandarin. Oh, Mandarin too. All right, Chinese. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. Okay. This is a good language. I start thinking is the the best than the English. The oh. fourth language is English. Oh, okay. But the second one, Chino Mandarin, is the third one, Portuguese. Oh, okay. Interesting. Nice. What about Henry? If you were to learn another language, which other language would you choose? I choose the French. French? Because I love the food. 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 All right, yeah. Okay, yeah. especially in the hotel, right? Uh, that you get many visitors from that speak uh, yes. French. Yeah, all right. Ah, oh, interesting. What about Moises? Hi, Moises. Moises. Hi, hi. No, he's not listening. <laughs> All right. For I your teacher, would you like to learn? Ah. I think I, would, mm, I wouldn't like to learn. Well, no, I'll tell you what I would like to learn. I would like to learn Italian and I would like to learn Japanese. But I do not 
I mean, I'm not for French. I, I just don't like French. I, I feel guilty about it, but I don't. It's just, I don't. But you know what, though? I think it's way too difficult. Like the pronunciation for me, it would be way too difficult. So I. But Italian is, but Italian is so similar to French. No, it isn't. <laughs> is it? I, I find it a little bit. Yeah, because I, I hear some, some people from Italy and yeah. I. I hear it. They say similar. they sound the same. All right, yeah, I guess. Yeah, but yeah, I think Italian would be nice and Japanese. Uh, just yeah. about it. <laughs> Moises, we can, I don't know, can you say something, Moises? Moises? I guess we cannot hear you. Moises is asking if you can hear. If you're saying something right now, Moises, no, we can't. <laughs> All right, very good. Hi, Eric. Hi, how are you? Hi, nice to see you. All right, and also Gerardo. A ver, Eric, we're asking if you would have to learn another language or if you could learn another language, which other language would you like to learn? Hi, Eli. Which another language? Um, uh, difficult. Um, French. Okay. <laughs> All right. Or, or, or Italy. Italian, Italian. Italian. Ah, Italian. Okay, very nice. Interesting. What about Eli? Mm -hmm. Hi, Elita. Which other language would you uh, like to learn, Eli? Excuse me, teacher. Which other language would you like to learn, um, Eli? Um, I learn French. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, interesting, very good. And Gerardo, what about you? Gerardo's always so comfy. Good evening. You're going to fall asleep, Gerardo. Wake up. Come on. <laughs> yeah, for me, I'm I interesting uh, Portuguese. All right, okay, Portuguese, interesting. Hmm. All right, many languages. All right, very good. Well, hopefully you guys will learn one day the other languages that you wanna learn. All right, it would be very nice to do so, all right? The more you speak, the better it is. The more opens, I mean, the door. More, you open more doors with more languages, right? So that's interesting, very nice, very good, all right. Okay, guys, so uh, yesterday we were working on our books, right? On the manuals. Were you able to download the manuals from the platform? Oh. Yeah. yeah? No? I haven't. I haven't tried. Ah, you have got it. Okay, very I'm good. Okay. <laughs> we have to download, download yeah. something. In, it's on the, um, the manuals that we use. This one, I'm, I'm talking about this right now. Uh, Andre? These are the, um, the manuals that are on the platform that you can download them from the platform, all right? Okay. Because we're gonna be, I mean, we use them, all right? So uh, as we were doing yesterday. So what I'm gonna do right now, guys, I'm gonna, take, um, I'm gonna take you to the page that we were working with yesterday. Just give me a second. Neither nor, okay. So this is the one that we were working on yesterday. Were you able to finish these sentences? No, no right? No. Just... All right, let, let's do something. Okay, let's do something. Can you, I think he has the manual with you, but that's okay, or the book. So take a picture right now, and I'm gonna send you to your groups, okay? So you can like uh, work with them. Remember, you're using neither nor, okay? Teacher. Yes. Teacher. Okay, I got a question. Could you scroll scroll down uh, for the for the need or example? Yeah. Because I want to see. I was trying to to fill up the the homework in, at the platform, and I, it was kind of difficult for me to okay. uh, structure a need or uh, okay. sentence. Let me see need or knowledge gaps. Uh -huh, the man need. Okay. okay. Thank you. Yep. Yeah, we're gonna try it now. Yeah, try it, and if anything, uh, Oscar, you can text me, and I can help you out. Okay. Okay. Maybe on the on the uh, instructor. Uh, we have yeah. ten minutes. Yeah, we have. Are you gonna? This, uh, it's, yeah.
turn? I believe that today at 10, 10, 10 p.m. Ah, perfect. Okay. See? Yeah. All right. Sure. Okay. I yes. had a question too because mm -hmm. you just started to get the three, four to use near and ignore mm -hmm. in the beginning after the subjects yeah. after the subjects and birth right and the plans for what for i have to use ah uh, you know what i'm gonna while you guys are working on this i'm gonna check it right now so i can tell you because i can't remember right now all right okay but, because uh, yesterday okay. i made the sentence of birth ah. but our okay was, uh, i using the after the subject ah, okay all right okay. and he didn't take it right okay Okay, yeah. So take a picture of this right now, guys. I'm gonna send you to your groups, and while you're on your groups, I'm gonna be checking so I can help you out with that, okay? Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank, you. Thank you. All right. Did you take the picture already? Yes? Yes. Okay, yes. perfect. Okay. So uh, I'm gonna send you to your groups right now, and then while you're working on it, I'm gonna be checking that so i can help you when we come back okay hi diana good evening i'm jennifer hello hello teacher hi. okay there we go we're working on the exercise we were working yesterday so to finish it up okay okay there we go Diana Moises and Eduard, uh, Diana Moises and Irene, you okay? Hi, Eli. Hi. Hi, hi. Eli, la voy a mover, oye. Vaya. Porque Irene está, eh, se conecta en dos, en dos cositas, entonces me parece que está con usted, pero no está. <laughs> <laughs> Vaya, está bien. All right, ahorita, Eli, ahorita. La voy a poner con las chicas de, de antes. <laughs> Neither part not current. Not current. Cast and roller. Cast and roller next week. So we have a lot of And Karen. And Karen. Uh -huh. Neither yeah. Frank and Karen. Cast not. Neither Frank, comma, nor Karen. Nor Karen. 
Hasta el rollo. I listen my cat. Do you have a cat? Yes. Me no, but my son, yes. <laughs> ah, your son, son. Ah, your son. Yes, mm. my son. I was thinking the cat is a new classmate, I think. <laughs> <clears throat> the next one is raining. Neither he didn't provide a list of training. That's true. He didn't provide a list of training. He didn't provide any other alternative. In the same case, the last sentence. Okay? No. He neither provide. Neither. Neither. He neither. Or he provide neither a list of trainer nor other alternative. Ajá, pienso que va a quedar igual que la uno. The yeah. British are not interested. Me neither. Mm -hmm. After the subject. Yes, he neither. Neither. Neither the projects are neither. not mm, Yes, he neither. Provide a list of training nor other alternative. Number three. What the employee what number are you the... working on right now, girls? Yes, teacher. teacher. No. What number? Four. <laughs> One and two. Start number four. A lack of professional. Uh -huh. Neither. Neither. In the employees. Do you do you show them the number three? I write neither the employees are not interested. In the training, I write. Mm -hmm. And do what did you write? Is Ellie with you, girls? Yes, it is. Ellie is here. No, Ellie Larin. Ah, no, I am Ellie Salguero. No, I know, I know. Pero es que mandé a Ellie con ustedes. No está aquí. No entró. No, no teacher. No, she's not here. Mm. She's not here, teacher. Quizás se le desconectó la inter. Yeah. Okay. Maybe. Uh -huh. The employees. A lot of professional development program can help the company. Neither the employees uh -huh. are interested. Uh -huh. In three training, no. Oh, yeah. Hi, hi. Hi, hi teacher. Good evening. Hello, good evening, Vero. How are you? Tiene calor, Vero. <laughs> yes, I'm melting, teacher. <laughs> oh, my goodness. It's terrible right now? Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> I creo que se ve. Yes, I can I can see that I think. the margin. Okay, uh, in the sentences. We work near in the past. Okay. Yes. Steve Jobs nor Bill Gates. Neither the steel Joe nor Bill Gates has finished college. College, okay.
The next one. The next one. Education authority, authorities don't invest enough in education program for adults. Politicians don't invest enough in education programs for adults. I think... Neither. Educational authorities... Education. Neither educational authorities nor... Nor... Nor politicians. Politi politicians invest enough in educational program for adults. Okay. Neither, neither education authorities nor politicians invest enough in education program for adults. Yes, invest enough in education programs for adults. Okay. And that's so. That's I'll all. Finish. Finish. And yes. you do the you do the 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 homework in the, the platform. In yes, the platform. yes, I do that. But I had some ground because I use it in different ways, and okay. sometimes I use neither in the beginning, and in another yes. ways I use neither. In the middle after, of the after the subject because only you can use the needle in three in three position the teacher is played yesterday. But I had wrong question. Only four had good. Um um Jesse, I'm gonna show you this right now. Can you see? I'm gonna hold on. I'm gonna yeah. show you this right now. So these are some possibilities of you, like the way you can write them, Jesse. Can you see my screen? Okay. Yes, I can see you, your screen. Right. So for example, on the first one, he cannot speak English, he cannot write English. You can say he can neither speak nor write English, or you can write neither he can speak nor write English. All right. Or the other one, sometimes uh, two, like, two answers will be like, okay. He neither ate the cake himself nor allow others to eat it, or neither he ate the cake himself nor allow others to eat it. So you may take a picture of this, Jesse, so he helps you out. Okay. Okay. I take a picture because yeah. I have to study a lot. <laughs> yeah. All right. Gerardo, did, were you able to see it, Gerardo? Yeah. Yes, I see it. Were you able to take a picture too, Gerardo? Yes, yes, I take ah, Okay, the, yeah, so it down. helps you out a little bit, okay? Yeah, very good. Thank you. So did you finish the exercise already? The sentence? Uh, yes, I finished. Okay, yes. Okay. So give me like I two finished. minutes and I'm gonna wait for other groups to finish up. We're coming back, we're checking them, and then we start the new topic for tonight, okay? Okay, okay. thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I believe it's in the past, the past tense of finish. Hello, 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 hello. Uh, how are you? Finish up. Uh -huh. um, uh, yeah, yeah, I think it's a college. Oscar, who's typing, you or Eric? Eric is typing. Ah, Eric, I... watch, watch the spelling on neither. Neither. <laughs> okay. The spelling. And, okay. Any eye? Uh -huh. Neither, neither. Yeah. <laughs> and, yeah. Neither. See, I had my, my word, the uh, was stuck because I, I have trouble with the office in my, compu in my computer. Oh, really? Yeah, uh, I think it's the, related to the, to the, to the virus <laughs> no no, no. I'm kidding. <laughs> i didn't i didn't buy the the, the office so oh, <laughs> oh i see <laughs> that it's happens to one. <laughs> uh -huh. so it's, it's giving me trouble but next oh, okay. in the next session i, I will be typing i promise okay. you that's okay that's <laughs> okay <Oscar. laughs> uh -huh. neither 
education. You know, uh, we were having, I, I was trying to fill out the, the, platform. the homework, the mm -hmm. platform. Mm -hmm. And I have a lot of, uh, I, uh, I'm having a hard time. Uh, okay. Solving the neither nor uh, structure. You know what? I'm going to, uh, Eric, I'm going to stop sharing your screen and I'm going to share mine for a second. Okay. Okay. Uh, can you see Oscar? Oh. Can you see my, my worksheet? No. Could you, you make it? Can you see it now? <laughs> oh, wow. It, now it's. <laughs> now it's enough? It's enough. It's All enough. right, very good. So here, these are, these are like the exercises. So you say, for example, he cannot speak English, he cannot write English. So you can uh -huh. say he can neither speak nor write English, or you can say neither, no va a escribir esto. <laughs> no, 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 no. speak nor write English, all right? So you, in some of them you have choices, all right? Like uh -huh. you can write either this one or that one. Uh -huh. um, the same thing with the other one. So you may take a picture of this if you want, um, Oscar, so he guides you. Oops, sorry. So he guides you a little bit. Okay. Okay. I got it now. And, and Eric too. You may you may take a picture of this if you if you need to, Eric. Oh. All right. Okay. He cannot speak in English. Uh -huh. He can neither speak nor write English. Mm -hmm. I had I was trying to. This is this is one of the of the sentences. Mm -hmm. I was typing on that did way. You, did you write a period at the end, Oscar? Oh, well, he can. Okay, uh, okay. maybe I didn't write the, the yeah. verb. The oh. verb. So you have to use the, the subject after the verb. Right, yeah. Mm -hmm. They need it. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. All okay, right. thank so, you. Thank yeah, you. you're welcome. All right, so uh, you're still working on the other stuff, right? Right, uh, we're almost to finish. Yeah, we're almost okay. Done. Yeah, okay, perfect. Yeah, I'm going to stay here, but I'm just listening. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, so we are on the, okay, let me check the last, uh, the number seven, uh, Eric, let me just, number, let me the number six, number six. Okay. Okay. Number six. Let me see. Education authorities don't invest enough in education programs for adults. Politicians don't invest. Okay. Okay. Neither. Education authorities. Uh, neither. Uh, uh, neither. I believe it's neither education authorities uh -huh. nor nor politicians. English? Politicians in plural. Oh, politicians. Politicians invest. Enough. That will be the uh -huh, the last part of the sentence. In education programs for adults, for adults. Okay. Only, only six. Mm -hmm. Only six, we only have six. And then oh. this, and this, but what? I can... No, it's big enough, it's big enough. Okay. Oh. What do you think, Eric? I, I think it is covered uh -huh. because I tried to make the exercise. Yes, uh -huh. uh, I was made the exercise. Mm -hmm. And uh -huh. yes, equal. Okay. And this in this case in this picture that teacher show in in the screen what 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 he what she sell. Oh, so we were. Uh -huh. This is an example. Oh. Those are examples. Oh.
Hi guys, is everybody back with me here? Yes. Hi, Chef. We're back. Oh, Agri, you're yes. back. Very Hi. good. <laughs> Hi, we're back. I come Everybody back. back. Excellent. All right, guys, I'm going to share with you the answers of the exercises, and I want you to, like, check them. We're going to read them together anyway, all right? So here we have, this is the exercise, all right? Um, can you read, can you guys read the first sentence, how it is, because I cannot be sharing both the screens. So can you read both sentences and then tell, tell me if you have it the way it is? All right, so maybe Diana, can you, can you tell us, can you read number one for us, Diana? Yes, uh, neither Frank nor Karen has enrolled for the training next week. Okay, so that's how you have it, Diana? Mm, neither Frank uh -huh. nor Karen yeah. has enrolled for the training. Yes, I, I have it okay. at the same way. Excellent, very nice. All right, Jennifer, can you read number two and check if you have it the way uh, it's supposed to be? Okay, he provides neither a list of trainer nor any other alternative. Okay. But I change the positions neither before provide. I he, correct uh, it. He neither provided. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yes. He Did neither you, provided. Okay. Or, you, yes, uh-huh. Yeah. I'm sorry, but you said um maybe I'm wrong, but but yesterday we said that you don't have to use any because it's negative. Because for number two. Mm -hmm, for number two. He provided neither a list of training nor any other alternative. Mm -hmm. And yesterday we said it was negative, right? Jesse said it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh -huh, that was kind of weird. Um, but it, but they're using it here. What is the? Can you, Diana? Can you read the the sentence that it was given on the book? Oh, okay. That it was given on the book. Okay, read. <laughs> he didn't provide a list of trainings. He didn't provide any other alternative. Yeah. Yeah, but any is not correct. Yeah, any is not really negative because it's like any. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. It's not, yeah. Anybody. I understand. Right. So, or nor it gives you the negative connotation, but any doesn't. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. It's not so, negative. Right. Okay, okay, very good. Je uh, Jenny, Jennifer, yeah. Jennifer, you were saying yep. you said he neither provided a list of training nor any other alternative. Yes. Okay. But I change. Okay, but remember, there are different ways of saying it, all right? Like, if you notice yes. here, in example number one, neither is at the beginning, all right? Yes. In example number two or exercise number two, they have it after the verb that I was telling you yesterday. Subject, verb, neither. All right? Yes, mm -hmm. So we can play with it in like three different ways. So don't feel like, oh, no, I got it wrong. A menos que lo haya puesto hasta el final, ¿verdad? <laughs> that would mm -hmm. be completely <laughs> like, no, right. Very good. Oscar, do you mind reading number three for us, Oscar? Okay. The employees are interested neither in free training nor in online alternatives. Okay, very good. All right. So in this case, they're using it after the adjective, like are interested, all right? So the employees uh -huh. are interested neither in free training nor in online, tra in, in online alternatives. Or you could have said neither the employees are interested in free training nor in online alternatives. Okay, so you can play with it, all right? So let's see. Um, who else is here? Um, Diana was working with Andrea, right? Sure. In the yes. number three, mm -hmm. in the number three, okay. can be the employees leader are interested in free train, trainer, nor in online alternatives. Neither are interested. Yeah, you can play, you can play with the neither, uh, Jesse. You can even put it at the beginning. Neither the employees are interested. So remember that you have different ways of going about it here. All right? Yes, in yes. my case, I, mm -hmm. I put neither at the beginning. Yeah. Neither the employees are interested in free training, nor right. in online. And, and you know what, guys? This takes me to the, uh, the exercises on the platform. They, you can, like Jesse was asking me, which one, which way can be correct? All right? So. Right now the platform was fixed, so you can have it 
in the beginning or in the middle. So you try, all right? I mean, but it, one of the ways is correct. All of the ways are correct, okay? But you in the platform, kind of like try writing at the beginning. If not, it should take it right. But if not, try in the middle, all right? Like subject, verb, and then neither, all right? So kind of play around okay. with it, okay? Let's see. Follow now. The, yes. What follow the instructions, teacher. The instructions? Follow the rules. Yeah, follow about the, the rules, yes, okay, yeah. All right, what about number okay. four, guys? Can you read Verito? I mean, Vero, can you read number four for us? Number four. Um, I I have the same neither of a lack of <clears throat> professional development programs, nor a lack of incentive for learning can can help the company grow. Okay. So neither a lack of professional development programs nor a lack of incentives for learning can help the company grow. All right. So if you notice, they're using neither here at the very beginning. All right. What about number five, guys? Who wants to do number five or read it, please? Okay, teacher. Thank you. Neither Steve Ho Jobs. Joe Jobs. Neither <laughs> Steve Jobs nor Bill Gates. Finish at college. Oh, wow. Is that true? Do you guys know if that's true? Yes. <laughs> Both were dropouts. Wow, imagine. And players, eh? <laughs> Intelligence. Businessman, right? Oh, my goodness. All right, very good. And the last one, Andre, can you read it for us? Okay. Neither education authorities nor politicians invest enough in education programs for uh, adults. For adults? All right, very adults. good. Adults, very good. Neither education authorities nor po politicians invest enough in education programs for adults, all right? So this is like, if you want, you can take a picture of this so you can have it also. If you notice they're using it, uh, they, are, they are using neither nor, in different positions, all right? But at the end, they make, like, they are all correct, okay? okay? Hi, Guillermo, welcome. Thank you, teacher. How are you? Very okay. good. <laughs> Excellent, very good. All right, I'm gonna stop sharing this right now with you guys. And I'm going to find the other thing that I want to show you for today's class. Just let me find it. It's right here. I just have so many windows open. <laughs> All right. Guys, so what we're going to be talking today, it's we're going to keep on talking today about the trainings and why i mean we have talked about like why is it important the advantages and disadvantages and everything all right so i want to present a short video to you and i want you to hi normita oh my goodness everybody's here i was worried where's norma where's guillermo i'm so glad you guys are here <laughs> okay no that's okay norma welcome all right so i'm gonna show you guys a short video I'm going to open up a presentation and then the short video. And I want you, when we listen to the short video, I want you to take notes, okay? So we can practice your listening, all right? Uh, so make sure that you have your pen or pencil ready so you can take notes. So right now, let me, let me open the uh, presentation I have for you guys here, as well as the, um, the link of the video that we are going to be like watching today, okay? Is, guys if you have had the chance to see the manuals that we use uh, they come this way I'm just gonna explain it to you so you guys know uh, for example we just finished doing this exercise okay the the uh, neither nor kind of thing and the exercise is here after that you have uh, like a couple of links of videos or articles that are on the web that you can like uh, either watch or you can read all right and sometimes I, I take uh, the, the videos from here or sometimes I look for others, all right? What happens is that sometimes the videos may not be like currently like available. So that's why I try to look for other ones, okay? So that's what uh, pretty much you will find. So there's like not, this is not a typical English book where you can find a lot of grammar. If you notice, the grammar is a little bit, okay? And then you have links of it. So what you can do is like listen to them, all right? 
And then here you can try again some other exercises that we uh, are gonna be working with later on. So here we, guys, uh, here we go, guys. I just wanted to show you this here. Let me see here. So because we have been talking about, ah, Williams, hello, Williams. Que le había pasado? Oh, I was working. <laughs> I know. Ah, yeah. So he's está fuera todo el día. I just remembered. Very good. Yeah, you're right. At home. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, you just got home. Thank you, Williams, for being in class. I appreciate it. Okay. So last classes, guys, last week and everything, we, have, we were talking about trainings and everything, and we have mentioned these trainings before. The types of trainings pre previously mentioned, all right, we have mentioned about the technical or technological training, quality training, skills training, soft skills training, professional training, and legal training. Maybe some of them we have not mentioned, but we have been like around, okay? Yeah. Team training, managerial training and safety training okay so some of them we have already talked about and some of them we haven't really talked about okay but these are like pretty much if you look on the web about the types of trainings this is these are like the most common ones okay but again depends on the business depends on your company depends on your boss depends on your manager depends on the employees about the type of trainings remember that these ones Within, for example, the soft skills training, we have this uh, like critical uh, thinking training, all right, or uh, decision making training. So within this one, we have little ones, okay? So these are like the big, I don't know, the big thing, the big picture, and within them, we have little ones that are there, okay? Now, the question or the topic that we have to go about today is, to identify training needs, okay? So how do you identify training needs of our employees or us as an employee, all right? So I, I, what I want you to do right now, I'm gonna send you again to your groups. I'll give you like five minutes because I just want you to talk about it. Don't write anything, all right? So how do you identify the training needs? What I want you to do, last time we did something similar, thinking, okay, if I'm the manager, if I'm the boss, what do I do, all right? Or what kind of training I have to send my employees to. But now I want you to think as an employee, not as the owner, not as the manager, not as the supervisor. So if by any chance you are the owner, you are the manager, you are the supervisor, a step out of your position and think mm -hmm. of, an employee, you as an employee, all right? Mm -hmm. What kind of training and how? Well, don't think about the kind of training now, no. What I want you to do is you, or how would you like to identify the training that you need? For example, Oscar works at the airport, okay? So Oscar, what I want you to think is, okay, what kind of training would I like to have and how would I know that I need that training? All right, do you understand my question? Mm -hmm. All right, or Diana, for example. Mm -hmm. Diana, I want you to think about like you being the employee, all right? I'm thinking, okay, so this is the job I do. What kind of training I would like to have? What kind of training would I ask my boss to give me according to the job I'm, I'm doing right now, okay? And the same thing for Jesse as a teacher, Jesse and Ellie, Larin also as teachers. What kind of training would you like to have? I'm not asking which trainings they send you to, all right? Because sometimes, and we have talked about this before, eh, they send you to trainings and you're wondering, why am I, like, what am I here for? Okay, this is related to my job. I wish I could have gone to another one. Or sometimes you think, ah, it would be good to have, for example, English teachers. It would be good for us to always have grammar trainings, okay? Because we need to teach grammar, all right? And grammar is very difficult. Sometimes we are sent to, I don't know, like um, phonetics training, but sometimes we say, oh no, but you know what? A grammar training would be nice. Now, how do I, me, Jessica Cerritos, how I know, how do I know that I need this training? Is it because I lack of the experience? Is it because I lack of the knowledge? Is it because I know how to speak it, but I don't know how to like explain it? All right, so this is what I want you to think. Okay, so, okay, for example, I, I, me as Jessica, I would like to have a grammar training. 
how do I, how do I, me, identify that I need that? Ah, because I don't know how to explain grammar. All right, you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, guys? Yes, yes, yes. yes. Okay, so uh, let's go and then we're coming back. I'll take attendance. Yeah, in like five minutes, I'll take attendance and then I'll send you back, okay? So we're like ping pong today, okay? <laughs> All right, here we go. question about my my needs as an employee because uh, I am the owner but I work in there too so to perform as an, a good employee I, I need some kind of training maybe it's in uh, in administrative in administration stuff I don't know because that's my my job uh, to administrate the funeral home. That's my main uh, occupation. My main mm -hmm. job is, is that. And, and sometimes I think I, I would like to have like technician uh, training in about uh, in, in embalming stuff. <laughs> I would mm -hmm. like to, to know about that. Maybe because to a big, because I like to, to know and document the process of the Involving, involving in itself. So yes, I think it's very important. Yes, I would like to have that type of, of training. Mm -hmm. I, I, I think it's very important the administration part. I, if I saw a, a site that calls Coursera. Com. Oh. Dot com. <laughs> and it has a. a, a trainings for every um, kind of, of topic. Oh, thank you. Yes, <laughs> and have an app too. <laughs> oh, that's great. Thank you yes. very much. Okay, uh, I I would like to, like a- uh, like, Andre, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Andre, is that the, the, uh, the site that you mentioned, is it a free site? Yes, it's oh, a, cool. some. If you want, a, a, how do you say diploma? A diploma, a diploma, yeah. Diploma. Ah, okay. Uh, you have to pay, but if you want to to receive the course, uh, you can do it for free. Cool. Without oh. the diploma. Yeah. Yes. Okay. And it's a lot. A... She's frozen. <laughs> <laughs> And we are like, what? Like, what? <laughs> I'm not kidding. <laughs> Trees. Yeah. Yeah, she froze. Yeah. Really. Uh, Diana. Okay. Oh, there she is. All right, Andrea, okay. you got frozen. <laughs> 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 okay, so what's the name of okay. it, it uh, Andre? What's the name of it, you said? The name of the uh, Coursera. 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 Excuse me. That's cool. Okay. All right. Cool. Yes. And another another play uh, site that I saw is uh, Stack Skills. Okay. Interesting. Thank you, Andrea. Yeah. Very. But, but I think that the the site is it's paid. <laughs> You're welcome. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. Nice. Okay. 
All right, so you girls keep on talking about the type of training you would like to have as an employee. <laughs> Okay, thank you. Um, okay. um, I would like to, to, to have training about uh, digital marketing because I, I'll share. Hello, Moises. You cannot speak either, Moises. <laughs> Hello. You can. Hi, Moises. How are you? Hello. Hi. <laughs> Can you hear me? Yes, Can I you hear, hear you. Me? Yeah, I hear you well. Hi. Okay. I'm really sorry. That's okay. No, but don't worry about it. The okay. reason that that when I was we we talking with writing, we we have some problem with the connection. Okay. Okay. That's okay, Moises, that's okay. So you know what you can do, Moises? Yeah, you can do the exercise by yourself, thinking, okay, me as an employee, what kind of training I would okay. like to have, okay? And how yep. do I know that I need that training, okay? And just give me a second, I'm gonna go check on. Okay. Thank you. It is the boss for the process. And we need to take action when the process not are improving. And um, we need to evaluate the causes and make the corrections. For this reason, the company uh, try to use the technical information for um, improve the Power BI da data for weekly, monthly, and year-to-day numbers. Mm. Also, uh, yes. Also, uh, I need to learn more or teach more for AutoCAD because AutoCAD. Main, main AutoCAD is a software used to yeah. design the layout, the um, tools, mm -hmm. or attachment need to use or development for the machinery in order to, to make more faster or with more quality the actual operation you have to you have to review any any time you have to review any product or any report yeah we produce and not only review do you make no make in design. Uh -huh. I make. Uh -huh. Normita, I'm sorry, Norma, to interrupt. What is your position at the company? I am industrial engineer manager. You're a manager, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. So, but it's, you know what? It's very interesting because you as a manager, you still, I mean, I think you need like more trainings because you are like in a position where you need to like help others right yes teacher. all right for example she training I, I, the others yeah the other uh, employees right uh -huh. yes of course yes. Yeah. No, and another thing uh, for example in my case i processing a lot of data uh -huh. for daily daily information for country for plan for <laughs> unit for sale right. and, by, yeah. and by operator. Wow. And no, maybe <laughs> the, the plan maybe can have more than 1,000 uh, people. Imagine, it's a lot of information. Of course, no. For the reason, in the first step, I learning about the Excel, uh, uh, advanced Excel. Advanced uh -huh. Excel. In order right. to make a macros, of course of, of data. but it's enough because the time in investment for the clerical mm -hmm. was a, a lot of time right. always delivery the information late mm -hmm. the, the top manager needs the information daily in the morning no way norma daily in the morning i know the morning. yes in the in my company, for example, my boss, the yeah. information sent around to eight o'clock. Okay. Yes. Yes, okay. eight a.m. Uh -huh. To managers 
uh, from production right. and um, general manager. Okay, all right. Yeah. Okay. Jenny, okay. Now, now in your case, Jenny, which kind of training do you think you need? You was Jennifer, Carolina, which, uh, which training do you think, oh, I, I wish I could have this training? In my case, it's a uh, technician training in mm -hmm. pattern. Okay. And in programs, for example, uh, Gerber or Morgan. Okay. Because uh, I test the, 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 I test the, the patterns to production. Okay. And right. I try to, to convince the, to my boss <laughs> because the, because the training is expensive oh my around God. around seven thousand five hundred dollars yes serious Jane. for one year six mm -hmm. months okay. around one year six year months half. because okay. it's, it's so complete right the, 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 the training yes right. it's a knowledge of course. And not only known yes, because it's Gerber is a Gerber and Morgan was uh, were uh programs to design patterns. Okay. To production. All right. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. All right. Ellie, wow, what yeah. about in your case? Ellie, which kind of training you would like to have? You as J Elizabeth Salguero. <laughs> Uh, I was thinking about the training needs. Mm -hmm. I believe that uh, I need the training, uh, something like that, the goods and service. Customer because service, yes. My goods and service because my position in, the, in my work is mm -hmm. reception. Of course, yes. Reception. Uh -huh. Reception. Mm -hmm. it, sometimes it's easy. But when the when the weather, no when when the when uh, when the sign is normal, uh -huh. is is a little hard because I receive a lot of calls, a lot right. of calls, and calls, and calls. Uh, the owner that I work, uh, they have uh, six radios. Okay. Uh, that I that I. That I no that I am secretary for the six races. Oh my goodness, Jenny! <laughs> about the quarantine, about the quarantine, it was a uh, relaxing for me. <laughs> of because, <course. laughs> because and I never and I never and I never rest in a lot. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> it's eh? a stressful. But, but we we. We didn't stop. To I know. You, yeah, you told me you didn't. We yeah, didn't. you told me. Yeah. Uh -huh. But only we had to work a few hours. Okay. The normal time we have to work eight hours. Right. Uh, actually, we have to work six hours. Okay. okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah, it's interesting when you talk about different jobs and different jobs positions different because sometimes. Job. You may work at the same company, but the position is different, all right? So my needs yeah. are gonna be different than your needs, all right? My training is different than your training. But I think there are trainings that everybody should have, all right? For example, like dealing with people or dealing with conflict, like conflict resolution, I yeah. think it's needed for every company at any level, you know? Or like critical thinking skills also, teamwork, because sometimes, especially like, you know, when the, it, I know it's not your cases, but sometimes like the managers or the boss, they don't really relate with the people that are like under them, you know, but then the company is not really like playing in a, like in team kind of, kind of situation. All right. So to be able to deal or to, to work in teams is very important, but not everybody's able to. Especially yeah. in our culture, I think we, we tend to step over someone else to get whatever you want. And that's not playing fair, you know, and that's not being part of a team. All right. So I think there are some trainings that everybody should have at any, at any company, at any level. 
All right, but of course, everybody has different needs because everybody works in different departments or in different companies, all right? Girls, we're gonna go back. I need to take the attendance right now and then we're, we're, um, uh, we're discussing this as a group and then we, I'm gonna show you the rest of the PPT and the video, okay? Okay, thank, thank you. you. Hi, Moises. <laughs> Moises was waiting for us here. <laughs> mm. his, his connection is not stable right now, that's why, but he's with us. Uh. Yeah. yeah all right guys uh, i'm gonna take attendance right now so please say present if you're here of course all right let's see um nancy elizabeth larin chavez present elizabeth que yo no sabía su primer nombre <laughs> <laughs> yo toda la vida por e e eli verdad Very good. Sí. <laughs> <laughs> yo al principio si quiere nancy verdad I get it. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. A ver, Eric Alirio Pérez Díaz. Thank you. Eric Mauricio Paredes Hernández. Mm, él no ha estado entrando estos días, ya lo extrañamos. A ver. Vladimir del Cid Tepas. Pero Henry estaba, ¿verdad? He had a connection. Ah, okay, okay. So he's probably coming in later. Jose Luis yeah. Rivera eh, Gutierrez. Present. Moises Eduardo Alas Roque. Present. Thank you, Moises. Oscar Armando Bonilla Flores. Present. Cruz Yesenia Maldonado Tejada. Present. Diana Gabriela Hernández Morales. Present, teacher. Andrea María Trabanino Alfaro. Andre, Andre. Andre está frozen otra vez. <laughs> she got frozen. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. no, right. But she's but there. She's ahí, here. La, she's ahí, here. ahí la vemos. Okay. <laughs> Williams Alexander Rodríguez Argueta. Present. Thank you. Francisca Irene Lima Hernández. Aquí estaba también Irene, ¿verdad? Sí, se le descargó el teléfono. Ah, ok, sí. ah, pues ya se va a volver a conectar ella. Guillermo Antonio. Present teacher. Excelente. Jennifer Carolina Acosta. Ponía. Present teacher. Gerardo Daniel Gómez Rodríguez. Present. Norma Araceli Rivera Rivera. Present teacher. Elizabeth del Carmen Salguero Romero. Present. Silvia Marisol Villalta Martínez. Silvia igual estaba, ¿verdad? Ah, no, Silvia, no, 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 Silvia. A ver, Silvia, no. No, no, no. Eh, Verónica era, Verónica, pues, pero sí. Verónica está. Verónica Lizet Soto, pues, very good, thank you. Pero, Nubia Araceli Cortés Amaya, she's not in, right? No la he visto entrar. Ok. Siempre nos faltan tres en clase. Come on, guys. Podemos superarlo. <laughs> All right. Very good. Okay. Uh, let's see. I was, I was getting into some of your groups and I, I was listening to some of your answers. All right. So let's see. Oscar. You as Oscar Bonilla. All right. The work uh, that you work at the airport, that you have been working there for so okay. many years. Um, Which kind of training would you like to have, Oscar? And how do you know that you need that training? Wow, um, I was speaking. I was talking to to Eric. To Eric. Uh huh. Um, I told him that uh, we determine mm -hmm. our training needs okay. uh, using the the complaints. Ah, okay. Uh, because because we give a service. Yes. And 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 we are we are measure our services measure. Mm -hmm. by our clients okay uh and one uh one tool is the complaint the complaints i don't yes. want to say but the, somehow so uh, there's an interview uh i mean um 
no a interview, survey? it's a, like a, a survey. survey. A survey. It's a, sur uh -huh. a survey and complaints. Okay. And then... Um, like sugerencias um, box. Uh -huh. <laughs> and then the company determines what determines. kind of training do you uh, need. That uh, determines. Uh -huh. Okay, the, the all right. But me, uh, as... Uh, Oscar so Bonilla. Bonilla. <laughs> Sometimes I have a, I want to, it's a personal, uh, how to say, um, it's really hard in the, in the government to, to get a training just mm -hmm. because so you, you want to, how to say, I know well what I want. Okay. I know, I know what I want. Okay. But sometimes it doesn't uh, fit. Right on the on that on that job on right. the job because our training needs are determined determined are determined yes. by the company uh -huh. and there's no mm. so many choices right maybe sometimes they 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 place a like a Excel courses okay or Excel training computer yes. training yes and then the, the you have to fill out a in a for, uh, ah, okay. uh, form, right? And then uh, the human resources department will sign up that that form. Okay. But if I want a, a course mm -hmm. and I go to the human resource department and ask for and ask for support <laughs> and ask for 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 not for sponsoring actually, but support and yeah. I will pay. Uh, right. any given amount of, of money but less than the the, the, or the total amounts of, of right. the field but uh, I did once and I, I got in trouble so oh, all <laughs> I'm, right. not, I'm not willing to again to because, do it again right uh -huh, because they they just they tell you what to right they okay. tell you they determine you yes um, okay all right okay i guess that usually happens in the company right they the training needs are determined by the company by the supervisor by the type of you the job you do or make but but if you could oscar let's think about this wonderful world <laughs> where your boss would come and say oscar any training that you feel that you need which one would you like which kind of training or which training you would say, okay, this is the one I want to take. And they would say yes to everything you want, okay? So, Oscar, uh, what, well, training, or uh, why would you choose that training? The quality management, uh, quality management system, because we were, we were I've been involved in, in uh, quality assurance uh, activities at, okay. the, at the company, at okay. the department, and I need uh, more knowledge about okay. it. Ah, all right. Okay. You know, more knowledge because uh, I, I have a lack of, uh, of, I mean, I don't have training on that area. Okay. All right. Area. Or, but yeah, yeah. The, in this English, uh, by, but English is, is our, how to say, is our tool mm -hmm. in, in, in my working place. Right. You have to be bilingual almost by, a, by an 80%, 80%. Okay. Okay. I believe we are maybe most yes. of us are in 17%. 17%. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. So in, in this case, uh, the company offer us to, to join this this uh, ah. in this corporative through in support. Right. Okay. They offer us and, and we are here, but I didn't right. request it. <laughs> Actually, this I didn't All request. Right. But okay. I, I believe I'm in, in the highest level. I ah, mean, yeah, you are. Own. I uh have -huh, my co-workers, the other co-workers are in in, in, our... in in the lower levels. <laughs> no, not in the lowers, but they are maybe... Intermediate? Intermediate. Right. Intermediate. Uh -huh. Actually, this is the highest one we have right now, guys. So you are okay. the top of the scale right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Very Let's good. See. Interesting. Very nice. Thank you. Let's see. Okay. Um, Vero. Veronica Lisset. You as Veronica Lisset. Okay. Don't think about if your company is going to say yes or it's going to say no. But you, as Veronica, what kind of training would you like to have? And how do you know that you need that training? Um, for example, because I am public accountant. Right. Accountant. An accountant. And, yes. And for that reason, I have to be updated in different topics. Okay. For example, I like to be uh, updated in taxes. 
Okay. Standards, trade laws, mm -hmm. commercial law, and 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 the the government too demanded that that as we are updated in that in that topic because the government give us a number. Okay. And we we have to maintain that number. And ah. if we if we don't we don't uh, and if we don't are updated if with the updated. the uh -huh. topic that that I mentioned. Yeah that they, you mentioned. Uh -huh. They didn't uh, they didn't give a gate a member. All right. Like a membership. Yes. Like, ah, mm -hmm. all right. Okay. Yes, okay. like that. Okay. And personally, I need, I would like to train in, in a specific technical English about it, my career. For example, specific terms in a, in a compound in English. Yes. Okay. All right. Because I, I told you the last time that yes. the last year I went a uh, an interview. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you told me. Yeah, <laughs> and they knew the the person who are a, a contact, but I need to know about a specific terms about the contability. Right. Okay. About accounting. All right. Okay. Interesting. Very good. All right. Let's see, Diana. All right, I want you to think about Diana, the employee, not Diana, the owner. All right, <laughs> Diana, what training would you like to have as you, Diana, Gabriela? <laughs> yes, <laughs> yeah, yes. Uh, we were talking with Andrea, Andrea. Mm -hmm. that um, I'm the owner of my own company, but I have uh, a job in there. So right. I, my principal job is to administrate the, right. the resources that we have. Right. Okay. So I would like to have uh, a, a specific training in that area. So, and maybe in financial, 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 financial okay. terms or, okay. or stuff ah. like that. Okay. So I would that kind of uh, training I would like to have. But sometimes I focus more in in sales training ah, or okay. customer service tra right. training because that's yeah. that's the more urgent training right. that, that, that we need right yeah mm -hmm. okay very good interesting very good uh williams what about you williams alexander which training you say okay no i would i would like to have this training and how do you know you need it or how do you know about about it okay uh we work with uh different communities in el salvador mm -hmm. different pure communities so uh, we working in community development okay so uh, we need different training about this topic right. uh, almost social science uh, related with mm. community development okay. because is we have a, a big um, scene about this for example violence abuse, mm -hmm. uh, development, economic devel development. Right. So we need training about those. It's change, changing continue. Right. Uh, so uh, we need to know about the laws, the, the recent laws mm -hmm. about these topics. Uh, right. A new law about violence, a new law about abuse mm -hmm. uh, where people can go in he are a, a victim from right okay yeah all right okay so you would like to have like trainings related to violence or gender and all those kind of kind of yeah. okay all right i am in a training related with uh, Want to say feminista violence? All right, like okay. I, I, yeah. So uh, and we are learning about this topic. Cool. I would like to learn about that too. <laughs> All right. Interesting. Very good. All right. Let's see. Uh, Jesse, what about you, Jesse? That you're a teacher. Uh huh. You, Jessenia, which kind? Of 
and that you would need you yourself. Yes, I had a lot of training I, that I want to improve, mm. but the fear training is a call center training mm -hmm. because I had a dream that working in one call center. My dream is working in a case call center. Okay. Then I, I have to improve my English level. Mm -hmm. I have to know about call centers, a lot of things. Okay. And that is the training that I would like to improve mm -hmm. for principal things. Okay. But I want to improve to also the technical or technology technology training. Okay. In quality training. Okay. Because for for you apply for a new job, you have to have a good quality. Mm -hmm. Quality for applied and had a technical and technolo technology knowledge too, because it's a part that you, that all the business are are one requirement for requirement. Okay. Requirement. All right. For okay. you to apply for one job. Okay. That's Interesting. So. Okay. Very good. Andrea and then Guillermo. All right. Let's see, Andrea. What What about you, Andrea? Uh, I would like to join in a training about digital marketing mm -hmm. because uh, with this this topic of the pandemic and, and, and all this it's very necessary to have these platforms uh, running at the best at, okay. at, at the best um, way okay and I need to improve in 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 Google Ads, in identify mm -hmm. keywords, and all this stuff okay. that right. are, is very important for the business. Okay, nice. Thank you, Andrea. And what about you, Guillermo? Okay, and I'm talking with Irene. Uh -huh. Our work is similar with uh, the Joe. Joe, okay. um, some training will be an uh, effective time. Mm -hmm. mm. um, and teamwork. Yes. Uh, self care. Okay. Mm, nice. Uh, different workshop on, on the use of material okay. to learn about the different workshop we, in which it, it can offer your people. Okay. If for me, uh, I need a practice English for mm -hmm. the different business from my job. Okay. All right. Interesting. Very good. Now, um, I was talking to Norma and Elizabeth and Jennifer, and I was um, telling them that it's really interesting because we are like, let's say, 17, 18 people in this class, and everybody has like different needs and different, like the type of training that you would like to receive is different all right some of them might be quite similar but at the end of the day you may work at the same company but if your position is different in that company your needs are different all right and you as a person also need something different than what i need for example all right so that's really interesting but i don't know if you guys would agree with me or not but i believe and i was telling norma's group that it doesn't really matter which company you work for or the department that you work for or the position that you have at your company. I think there are some trainings that should be mandatory for everyone, all right? Like customer service, we all deal with people, all right? It doesn't matter if you're the manager, the owner, the supervisor, the teacher, uh, the one that is behind the computer doing these marketing strategies and everything at the end of the day is going to get to someone. All right. So I believe that like, um, customer service is something that you like, everybody should like have a training of, you know, because we are dealing with people all the time. And I don't know if it has that ever happened to you, but sometimes you go to this office or sometimes you go to these, um, business and whoever is there helping you is not really helping you all right or they are mistreating you or they are not really like being nice to you and you feel bad and you feel angry sometimes and sometimes you even feel offended 
because at the end of the day, they're giving you a service and you deserve to be treated right. And sometimes, I mean, and I kind of wonder, so why do you have this job if you hate it? All right. I mean, it's not my fault that you are there, that you don't like this job, but you don't have to take it out on me. All right. It's not my fault you're there. All right. So it's really difficult. And sometimes, you know, I think about it. I, I think about this all the time. Sometimes you go to any, any place. All right. And they like even either they give you a bad look, a bad response, a bad face. And you're thinking, OK, wait a minute. If I would do this, me, Jessica Cerritos, if I would do this to my students, I wouldn't have a class, all right? We all have bad days, all right? We all have like, we all feel tired sometimes, all right? We all feel like we should, I don't know, maybe we wanna be doing something else right now, okay? But why do I have to take it on you? You, do you see my point? It's like, okay, fine, this is my job and I'm gonna do the best job I can, all right? So, but sometimes you go to this any place and then they treat you like you are their enemy, all right? And you're thinking, okay, so I don't know. So I think it's very important to have customer service, to have teamwork kind of training also, because we need to believe and we need to feel part of a team. All right, because otherwise the company is not going to work. And I, I think in many companies we feel like, okay, I, this is my team, but I don't like Oscar's team. All right, so I'm going to make Oscar's life miserable. All right, so there's this, you know, like enemy kind of environment, like I'm the best and you're the worst. And I can do it and you can't. So it's very difficult. And I think it's a matter also of culture, all right? Because we as Salvadorians, we tend to step on other people's head to keep on going, all right? And I think that has to happen to all of us in one point of our lives, all right? Sometimes you feel like, oh my goodness, all right? I mean, it's very difficult. So I think customer service, teamwork management, critical thinking skills, solve problem skills that those should be trainings that everybody should get at any level at any company all right for the company to work for you to feel better all right and sometimes it's like what oscar was saying i wish i could have the training but they're not going to allow me to get it all right and then we're kind of stuck but this goes back to like the first week of our classes when it's personal development also you know like this professional development has to be something personal and andrea was giving a site to diana where there are like many trainings that you can take online all right and they are for free also has a lot of trainings but people don't know about it okay this is one but there are many many trainings at InstaForth that they are free all right, so sometimes we don't know because we lack of information, because we lack of support from the human department of our offices and our companies, or sometimes we don't care, all right? So, but it's very important to look for that. If the company is not gonna provide it to us, they're not gonna support us, but what am I doing, me, Jessica Cerritos, to improve myself, you know, as a person, as a professional? So there are a lot of, things that we need to take into account. I don't know if you guys agree with me or not about certain uh, trainings that everybody should get at any time, at any company, at any level. What do you guys think? Soft the skills. And yeah. I believe you were talking about soft That's right. skills. Yep. Mm -hmm. I agree. All right. Maybe, maybe my father always says, says yes, that yes. Uh -huh that we are always selling, no matter right. what kind of job we are having in a company, we are always selling. So he says that uh, that every employee has to have, has to have mm -hmm. a training in sales. Right. So I think that that is really important because uh, since the mess messenger, mm -hmm. uh, they uh, from, uh, Every, every, every person in the company is selling right. the, the, right. the brand. That's so right. 
I think it, this is really important too. That's right. Yeah. Very good. All right. Any I other thing? That yes. It's important. Uh, two two trainings for me are too important for every areas. Yes. And one is the time manage management. 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 Yes. Management. And the second, uh, the, the emotional intelligence. Right, yes. I think that it's important. And don't teach at, at any university or a school. Right. No. But I think no. that it's very important. Right, yes. To work. Right, Andrea, very good. Anybody else? A teacher, we need to improve in, in any companies the relationship. That's right. Because yeah. uh, we always working with other people. Right. And you need to treatment for them as a, you receive that treatment. That's right, yes. Because many people is very, very staff or task mm -hmm. with, the, with the other co-workers and then uh, damage the relationship That's between right. department or between the, the co-workers. Right, yes. And all that uh, yeah. have a bad environment mm -hmm. and the people no feel better mm -hmm. and for the reason the people no give the better uh, um, the better um, job for the company right. right yeah i think it's a chain right i mean if you're not happy with the job because you're not being no no you're not being treated right you're not treating people right so it's like a whole circle here all right so we in a way we need to stop that all right guys i'm gonna show you this uh, we're gonna keep on talking about this these are uh, some key points that we need to know or we need to keep in mind when to like where to start from and how to identify training needs of employees all right so in, in the case of some of you that are managers supervisors owners all right or even us that were employees it's nice to know this that is going to help us to say okay so this is how they identify our training needs all right so number one is to decide what you're trying to achieve as a company as a department as as the owner as the manager as you as a person uh, number two identify the knowledge skills and abilities needed to meet your objectives all right so that's also important number three to figure out what employees know all right, because for example, if Oscar is a pro on something, why would I need to send him again? All right, maybe Andrea needs the training more than Oscar, so I'm gonna send Andrea to the training, all right? So it's important for you to know this, especially for managers and owners and everybody else that may, may be able to send the employees, all right? Number four, talk to employees. It's very important, guys. Sometimes we lack of communication in our companies, all right and i think it's necessary so talk to them find out what they want find out what they need and companies are probably gonna ask me jessica but in my company there are thousands of people true all right i'm not in your position but i guess you have to find a way all right i mean if you are in the position you are at it's because you're able to manage and you know how to make this happen so you need to find ways of how to talk to your employees all right Talk to managers, all right? Like if you're a manager, talk to the other manager and find out, okay, so how can we, you know, what are the, uh, how can we identify the training needs of our employees, all right? And kind of like share information, but all comes down to communication here, all right? Number six, decide on the data points that are valuable to your team. Again, what's valuable? Because maybe it's not for everybody, all right? Or maybe right now, we all we we're all supposed to be thinking on this COVID-19 thing all right so we need to think of about you know something but that is valuable for us all right we need to evaluate your current training resources all right so that's also important so make sure that you're always evaluating and then and last but not least you have to match your training to your needs all right and this is what we've been talking about before try not to send your employees to trainings that they don't need all right because then it's useless or pointless because they are going to go with a bad attitude they're not going to learn anything all right and they're not going to bring back anything to the company 
All right, so you need to match the training to the needs of them. And how do you identify them? Talk to them, all right? Define or decide what you want to achieve, decide or identify your objectives in order to send your employees to the training needs, I mean, to the trainings according to what they need. I'm going to show you this um, video here. All right, so I want you to take notes. Let me just see here, guys. Okay. I think it's like about four minutes or so. It's going to help us to, um, to listen. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is not the video. <laughs> this is the uh, article that I wanted you guys to read, but you know what? It's a session show teacher and then put the, the link. Yeah, but this is a, the different link, Norma. I had two links. Ah, okay. This one, this is the link of the, the uh, reading. All right, but you know what? This is what we're going to do. Um, let's just, uh, let me see here. Where's my link? Give me a second, guys. I want, I want, I want you to see the video. I had the video for you. <laughs> Just give me a second. I'm gonna stop sharing here. Just give me a quick second. Let me show. <laughs> That can be, guys. That cannot be possible. Okay, oh. Hold on, guys. I'm just trying to. Yeah, there you go. Okay, here it is. See, I told you I had two links. There you go. I got okay. it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to share the audio so you can hear it. Just give me a second here. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. In lesson two, we will unpack the process by which a trainer identifies a training need. But first, we must differentiate between macro and micro training needs analysis. On the larger organizational scale, training needs analysis helps HR professionals understand the overarching training needs of people in the organization. When it comes to developing a training session, trainers must use a formalized process to ensure the success in training content. That is the process that we will explore in this lesson. The purpose of identifying training needs is to help you plan for your training. A successful training needs analysis will identify those who need training and what kind of training is needed. At the core of effective training session design is a clear understanding and definition of training needs. An effective training session depends on the trainer knowing what is required by the individual, the department, and the organization. To gain some clarity on the practical application of training needs analysis, let's take a look at a situation you might encounter as a trainer. You are a human resource professional in a small organization. While interacting with a manager from your organization, you're asked to develop a course on water safety. So let's discuss this water safety training. You're asked to develop a training course on water safety. What kind of training might the person be asking for? Press pause now and complete this activity in your Ignore seminar that. workbook. <laughs> when you're completed, press play to continue the seminar. The point of this exercise is to highlight that the requester could be asking for a number of different training needs. Maybe to teach a group of people how to swim or how to operate watercraft safety on a lake. Identifying the subject of the training was difficult in this case. Now imagine identifying the information needed to design the course well. After clarifying the subject of training need, think about the basic information you will need to create a successful training session for your audience. Now let's discuss information needed a little bit more. Following your observations from our last discussion, what kind of information do you need to develop this training? Press pause now and complete this activity in your seminar workbook. When you have finished, press play to continue your seminar. 
Here are the five W's of training needs analysis. The why, who, what, when, and where. These five elements are essential to consider when analyzing training needs. First, why is the training needed? Second, who are the participants? Third, what is the training content? Fourth, when will the training take place? And fifth and finally, where will the training be conducted? Why is the training needed? Identification of the source of the training need, the expected benefits of the training, and what new or changed behaviors will result. Who are the participants? How many participants will be trained? What are the roles of the participants and how familiar are they with the content you'll be providing? What is the training content? Identify the subject of the training, specify the topics to be covered, and note the resources for use in training such as documentation and materials. When will the training take place? Identify the number of sessions needed and the dates for your training. Ascertain the appropriate length of your session and specify session meeting times. Where will the training be conducted? Find the physical location for your training, identify specific room setup details, and ensure you have all necessary equipment identified available for your session. Now let's complete exercise 2-1, importance of the five W's. Identify why it is important for a trainer to be prepared with the five W's of needs analysis. Press pause now and complete this activity in your seminar workbook. When you have finished, press play to continue the seminar. Now let's work on the development of your own training seminar. 2-1, My Needs Analysis. Using the worksheet in your seminar workbook, complete a training needs analysis for your training topic. Press pause now and complete this activity in your seminar workbook. When you have finished, press play to continue your seminar. In lesson three, we'll first identify. All right, this is what we're gonna do, guys, all right? So, uh, of course, this uh, short video that we just saw, it's about trainings and everything, and they, if you were taking it, you would have like a worksheet, but right now we're just listening to it, all right? I chose this one because it's interesting to hear about the five Ws, all right, and how you, trainer or you as a manager you really need to like narrow down your topic when giving uh training they were giving the example of this water uh water thing all right but it's very the the, the topic is it could be just anything all right so you need to narrow it down to something more specific okay i'm gonna take the quick attendance right now and for the last 10 minutes you're gonna go and you're gonna talk about what you remember about the video, what were the five W's, why are they important, okay? So just pay, pay attention to your uh, name. I'm, not, I'm just gonna go over the ones that were not here. Let's see if they were able to get in at any point. Eric Mauricio Paredes Hernandez. All right, he was not, us, he was not with us today. And Silvia Marisol Villalta Martinez, no. And Nubia Araceli Cortez Amaya, she didn't get in, right? All right, very good. The rest of you guys are still here. So I'm gonna send you right now your groups. Talk about the video, all right? Talk about the five W's and just kind of discuss about it, okay? Teacher, in the first attendance, I don't, I don't, I didn't hear my name, but I know if I was frozen. Yeah, no, but yeah, we, we all saw you and we say, oh, Andrea, okay. I'm here. <laughs> no, thank you, Andrea, you were here. Thank okay. you. So I'm going to open up the room right now.
W's. Okay, why, who, uh -huh. when, how, no, I don't, I think how. When, uh, how. Yeah, and, and, and I, I can imagine that is what. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. What, what, why, who, when, and how. When and where. Uh, and where, okay. Oh, okay, it's the five, it's the five W's. Yes, because the five of the five of them starts with a W, right? Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, what was well when why why we why the employee needs the the activity mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and then talk about who, who? and who is, okay who is going of, to go to the training, right? Uh huh. Yes. Who is the, the most appropriate person to go to the training? And okay. when the, the, the time to take the, the training? Where is about the place, I, I, I think? It say in the giving service or, or giving a product, the service is bad because they, they don't training at the beginning. Yeah, I agree with you. Okay, about the kind of information that we need um, for to a specific training, I think we need to know about the necess necessities of the people, people field, and if necessary, know the schedule of our team, I think, because uh, some people can't take uh, a training because they don't have the same time uh, to have, uh, for example, okay, in this case, <laughs> uh, we have different departments and we have different schedules. So when we have uh, a specific training, we need to stay all the personnel. So it's, it's necessary to focus in a specific time and all we can stay there. Okay. Uh, always about the video, I think that the purpose of identify training needs is make the plan for training. Yeah. Why, who, what, when, and where? Uh -huh, Aha, the, the five W's. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, the first question is, why do you need this training? Uh -huh. Why? Why, okay. Why, why is it is it for me the explanation? Uh, the video is uh, about the, um, the five, five word, words. Uh, for example, for example, who, what, where? Um, oh, I don't know. remember the other. Why? When? Why? 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 Oh. Uh, the different kinds of uh, mm -hmm. training. Uh, definite, definitely win. Need definitely what kind of uh, training uh, need the, the employee and, and ask to and the first step, uh, um, for example, and what kind. Who who needs who needs the training and um, the others? I remember uh, um, where where mm -hmm. and where. Where they they 
workplace the where the they this Andre, what happened? You're by yourself. Yes, because <laughs> I don't know what happened with Diana. But it's, ra well, it's, it's raining. raining here. I don't know if it's <laughs> you're getting wet. Yeah. <laughs> I'm moving. <laughs> okay. I don't know what happened with Diana. I yeah, I guess it's the connection then. Yes, it, she says that it's raining in, in her house too. Yeah, it's raining here right now, so maybe the connection is not very nice right now. But we're almost finished anyway. <laughs> yes. All right, very okay. good. Okay. I guess she's going to try to come back, okay? Okay. Thank you. In policy. The government. Ah, the government. Uh, political partidos. Ah, okay. Politics. Uh, because, because you are not uh, the sympathia con el partido. Ajá, ajá. If you don't follow. Uh, yes. A uh, political movement. Ajá. It, it's complicated. You, you will left behind. You will, be, you will be left behind. Okay. <laughs> she was hearing. You were hearing. <laughs> I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. I, no, I okay. was so I was so rude. I'm sorry. No, no, no. <laughs> <Left behind. laughs> yeah. You're right. You're right. It happens in the uh, actually in the in the government. Uh, yes. uh, how to say? Uh, it depends on. Uh, uh, it's a, it depends on. On, on politics, as you say, as you say, but uh, we have to we have to make our own developing plan, our, our own training plan. Huh? Yes. Sure, in CEPA is is a um, steady job. It's a steady. I mean, it's it's a good one. Um, uh, stable, it's a stable. I mean, uh, you, you're not gonna get fired uh, immediately, but but uh, in the other hand, it's a steady, it's steady in, in the way of uh, you. I, I haven't been promoted say from since I since I began the working with me, SEPA. I haven't been wow. promoted. And how long uh -huh. have you been working there for, Oscar? Uh, 16. 16 years. 16 years. Wow. 16 years. So when I was almost, when I was uh, almost getting a promotion, there were another uh, party. Oh, another party, my won, a, another party won the the election, the the, pre the presidency. Yeah. <laughs> and oh, then no. I didn't get it. And, I know, Oscar. <laughs> and and this this red one party uh, promoted another another people. Right. But it's okay, okay. I don't complain because it, uh, how to say you don't have to complain in, in public. In that, that's I right. just stay quiet, <laughs> quiet, and like that. But I I regret that I was almost getting my promotion. Then the presidency was won by the other party, and then I. I wasn't in, in the in the plans for promotions. Right. Actually, we, we grow up people. We grow up. I mean, uh, I used, I was supervising uh, some people, uh, some guys. Okay. That they after that they became my my boss my bosses. No I mean, way, my, Oscar! <laughs> oh no! And they are right now. And now that we have switched from from one party to another again. Yeah. Uh, okay, I can do anything because I, I cannot do anything because uh, because it's, it's the way it is they already got the promotion the, right. the, so I don't there's no plus how do you say vacancies yes vacancies, there's, yeah. uh, there, there, there are no back vacancies made I had to wait another <laughs> oh my goodness. So that's why I'm, I'm trying to prepare Eric. I, that's why I prepare, I try to pre prepare myself to to leave, to leave uh, that company. So sometimes you don't know. Yeah. You never know. If, you never if, know. 
you never know and i have to be ready because if i in uh, now i like i mean my comfort zone mm -hmm. and i just know how to say i only can work as a controller in sepa there's no other company there's no other place no neither country because in another country that you you won't get a job for that because it's national security job so so it's the way it is <laughs> wow oscar so that's that that that's a little bit complicated eh because i mean I, I mean i know that you i understand what you were saying that sepa is like a you know it gives you stability and everything but if anything uh -huh. what what do you do uh -huh. i mean if you are like to go out of that company what are the chances uh -huh. of getting another job <laughs> uh, getting hired in another job uh-huh because only sepa gives those services in what Salvador. about avianca it's different no, because avianca is, our, is one of our clients all right. We the service and, and the, the pilots are the our clients, the, the, the companies. So is this the way it is? Sometimes you know there are lucky, lucky people because uh, because I, I've seen also young people getting in, in SEPA and, and got uh, trainings, promotions, and thanks to God, and good for them. Right. Good for them. Sometimes it's luck. Oh, it's good. Maybe it's, right. it's okay. Uh -huh. Interesting. I don't know, Eric, how it is managing the thing right. <laughs> in your Eric, job, Eric. You, you work at a, a, like a private company or a public company? Public company. It is semi-autonomous. Autonomous. Mm -hmm. And Bandesal, Banco. Ah, yeah, you're uh -huh. from Bandesal, right. Mm -hmm. And there is, there is a much topic about the politics politics political political yeah. politics politics and there is change every five years okay when i change the president mm -hmm. uh, change uh the 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 majority personal the oh project. really wow yeah. yes it's very complicated did you survive <laughs> no yeah. kidding. I was gonna say the same thing. Oh no, Eddie. I survived. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> no, eight, but you're uh, eight, years, eight, eight, eight years. Okay, wow. No. Yes. Uh, oh every every December is complicated because finish that the, the contract. Con contract. Oh my goodness, Eric. Oh no. Yes. Right. And I can sign the, the uh, contract. The contract, yeah. The contract. Uh, every year, every year. Wow. I see. So and every uh, December, it's not so happy because you're nervous. <laughs> very nervous because the man, the manager decides. Uh, who stays and who goes. Continue. Yes. Wow. Every 20, every December 23rd. Oh, no, oh, like 31st. <laughs> no, 20, 23rd. Uh -huh. yes. In, in yes. separate, it's, the, it's almost the same for uh, administrative right. employees. Yeah. Yes. Those are the, the, the seasons. Uh, <laughs> okay, fighting the seasons. high seasons. <laughs> oh, my no, the, the fighting season wow. is yeah, in no December. December uh, wow. All right, guys. We're going to go. Interesting conversation, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, guys. So goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Bye, Williams. Williams. Se le metió el espíritu de Elmer. Yeah, all right. De Jose, de Jose <laughs> oh, Jose, no kidding. <laughs> all right, very good. Okay, guys, I'm sorry we took a little longer, but the conversation with Oscar and Eric was really interesting. Okay, so tomorrow we're going to watch the short video again that I played, like, like we just uh, saw, so we can, like, review about it and talk about it as a group, okay? Remember the five W's and everything, so 
Thank you so much for being with me. Remember that today we have the uh, the clase de apoyo y ya estoy tarde, así es que bye. <laughs> que bye. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Salud. Bye. 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 Bye.